Mikey, you can't beat me because my rich village is much better than your poor one. And now I will prove it to you. You cannot doubt me because what you have built is hardly even a village. Are you sure about this or not? <laughs> so let's start this battle already. Today we will check with you which village will be better, but I hmm. think you're not going to be lucky today. That's for sure. Mikey, I don't even know how to tell you. You don't seem to know who you're messing with. Huh? Because just look at the villagers. My villagers are the coolest and richest. Huh? But as for your villagers, I wouldn't say that. Although they are not so rich, they are really happy. And all your villagers what? have is money and nothing else. So, do you understand me? Uh, hey, what are you doing there? Huh? Are you a thief? I saw how you wanted to take the diamond house, huh? so I saw it all. It didn't work out for you. And get out of here as fast as you can, no matter what I see you here. Yeah. Do you understand me? If you're so cool, then let's see how you handle them. Now you won't be so arrogant, what? you guys. Do what you have to do. You can break whatever you want. I give you my consent, yeah. and no one can forbid you. Hey, Mikey, are you crazy? Why did you order them? Don't break anything here. This is not your village. Do you hear me? If you want money, then follow me. I'll give Woo! it to you. You have never had such money before. I think you will like it. Have you decided to give up and give up all your money? That's the right decision. I approve of it. You can also give me the village. <laughs> and what do you say to that? You're not so cool anymore? What, you don't really like stealing from me anymore, do you? So, let's throw away all your picks and get out of here while I'm kind, because I am very rarely kind, and I hope that I will not have any problems. JJ, it's not fair. I didn't know you had traps there. And anyway, what? why did you intimidate them? They just wanted to break your village. I mean, they didn't want to do anything wrong. Huh? Do you understand that? And what are you even doing there? What are you up to again? Mikey, you're going to find out for yourself now. You need to wait a bit. Yeah. But I'll tell you right away that you definitely won't like it. But the main thing is not to be afraid because you were the first to start this war. And I'm just finishing this mess and everything will be fine with me. Guys, go to this poor village and turn it into ruins. <gasps> oh my God, what kind of army of diamond golems is this? Yeah. Does this even happen? Or how is this possible and where did they run to? JJ, uh -oh. why are you doing this? Why did you order them to destroy my village? <laughs> we already have nothing at all. Don't you feel sorry for us? Guys, don't listen to him. I'm your commander. <laughs> so, level this village to the ground so that Mikey understands that you can't do what he does. Now it will be a good lesson for him, I hope. And such lawlessness on his part will not happen again. And so, we were able to prove that a rich village is much better than a poor one. Okay, since you've decided to play dishonestly, then nothing stops me either. So, now we'll see how your villagers react to the scales. I think they definitely did not expect this and will just run away in fear. And so, now I like this battle. We have even the odds. Do you understand me? No, Mikey, not that. Where did you get these blocks at all? This is some kind of mockery and it's much more dangerous than diamond golems. And now I don't like it at all. So let's get this over with as soon as possible. I see that you're not so cool anymore. Am I right? Well, I'm already calling it by the rules. You set your army on me. And now you won't laugh at the fact that a poor village doesn't mean a bad one. Golems, don't stand still. Let's destroy these scales because it's not funny anymore. There are too many of them here. And now it's not a joke anymore and no one likes it. And it's all because of you, Mikey. So now I'll deal with you myself so that you don't do such nonsense anymore. JJ, let's not go crazy and finally admit that I'm better than you. And then I think we can make sure that nothing happens and everything ends well for everyone. And if you keep doing nonsense, it will last a long time. Mikey, please, let's not do this nonsense. Okay, just give up. That's all you have to do, and I hope you get it right. You have no chance of winning my rich village, even with those weird tiny monsters. But who else are you? Why are you all crying? What don't you like? Well, I understand why they cry. You see what you feed them? Guys, let's go with me, and I'll give you money, and then you won't have any problems. 
you will be able to buy and eat whatever you want because in our village it is the only way and nothing else. And now, you will definitely like it, so you can stay in my village. Guys, don't listen to him. You lived in my village. My village is poor, but we are all friends with each other. What's wrong with you? I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. I'm trying for everything, but everyone doesn't like anything. Mikey, calm down. Your villagers like my village better. They just didn't know what it was like to live in a really cool village. And so, let's not say anything to me now. You lost, and everything that happened just confirms it. JJ, no, it's not fair at all. Do you realize that you're just mocking me? Or did you think that I wouldn't understand it? So, let's not do this nonsense anymore. And so, sooner or later, I'll finally realize that you've lost, and you're just afraid to admit it. And I hope that this will all end as soon as possible, because I'm already tired of it. Why are you throwing this rotten flesh around here? No one will eat it! So, you can finish this, and let's not summon these monsters anymore. And so, I hope that you will soon run out of these blocks, and you will not be so cool anymore. So, get out of here as soon as possible. No, I won't stop until this is all over, and I'll do whatever I wanted. So, why don't you stay here and let me blow up your village? That's all I wanted, so let's just give up as soon as possible and don't ask me any questions. Because you can't beat me, I'm going to win this battle, okay? Okay, I understand that we won't be able to come to an agreement with you today, so I'm declaring war on you. And now you won't be so cool when I'm done with this. Come on, give up, because everything that happens next will end very badly for you. Okay, I encourage this, and I hope that everything will turn out well for you. And I hope that everything will be fine with me and my village. Come on, you better not do nonsense and make the only right decision. And so, sooner or later, it will all end badly for you. And I hope that everything will be fine with me. You said you were up to something, but you still don't understand. You're fighting me, which means you don't have any chances. And I'm going to win for you. You have to understand that. And when I win for you, you won't be so funny anymore because it's going to end very badly for you. I'm going to build such a defense here at my rich village that no poor man will be able to get in here. So I don't even understand what you're hoping for because you don't have any chances. You're just wasting your time and I hope it all ends well. Hey, are you crazy? What are you doing here at all? What's wrong with you? Why are you turning my chickens into some kind of penguins? Is this some kind of prank? Let's get out of my village. You're not welcome here, and I hope you understand me. And now, you've already done enough. You can't get away with it that easily. And so, sooner or later it will all be over, and everything will be fine with me. So, let's just give up as soon as possible, and you won't do any nonsense. Mikey, I'll do whatever I want, and you can't stop me. So, let's not do any nonsense here, and then it will all end badly for you. So, come on, don't provoke me, or you'll run into something terrible. And then you won't succeed. So let's get this over with as soon as possible. I'm already tired of all this, and I don't want you to be in charge here and tell me what to do, okay? So sooner or later, it's all going to end very badly for you. I'm so tired of you, but then it will be more pleasant for me to defeat you in a battle, and I'm going to do it. So let's not do any nonsense here, okay? Because I don't like all this. And sooner or later you will realize that you have no chance. You can do anything, but it will end very badly for you. So, you don't even have to try to build your defenses. Do you understand me or not? And when I destroy you, it will be a lot of fun. But only for me. Do you understand me or not? You can do whatever you want, but you'll shut up when I finish what I wanted. And so, then I will laugh at you when you start crying and begging for help. And I think it will be a lot of fun. So, let's finally get this over with, because you don't even know what I'm up to yet. But sooner or later, I will finally get to you, and you will no longer be able to oppose me. Mikey, tell me, do you really hope that you can still beat me? Are you serious now or not? Hey, loser, I took the diamond block from you. Are you not so cool anymore? So, your defense is some kind of nonsense, and I hope that everything will be fine with me. Don't even think about taking anything from me. I won't give you anything, so don't even think about anything. And now, nothing will work out for you. I told you that you are a loser, and now you have no chance of destroying me. 
because you're losing, and I already know that, and I hope that you all understand that and won't ask me any questions. So, Mikey, I'm tired of you, and I'm done with this. Do you understand me? Now, you'll find out that I'm very serious, and you won't be joking anymore. And then you'll understand that I won't wait for you to do some nonsense here. And now I'm just going to destroy your village. And then you'll finally realize that I'm the coolest here. And then you won't have anything left of your village. Mikey, as quickly as possible, let's just give up so that I don't waste my time on you. Do you understand me or will you continue to do this nonsense? You think I'm going to be scared of your TNT cannon? Are you serious now? I know you don't even know how to use it, so let's get this over with and just blow up on this TNT as soon as possible because I'm tired of you. I don't even know how to fight you anymore if you don't leave your territory. And so, I hope that everything will be fine and that you won't be doing any nonsense here. I just don't understand what you want from me anymore. I didn't want anything bad to happen and all you do is mock me. The scariest thing for you is that this is just the beginning. Then I'll come up with something else scary for you, and then you won't be so cool anymore. So, let's get this over with as soon as possible, and sooner or later, you'll realize that you shouldn't have decided to agree to this battle, because I all know that the power is in money. Whoever has money is stronger, and you don't have anything at all except your village. And that's temporary, because I'm going to destroy everything in your village now. Don't you understand me? So. Let's give up and stop doing all this nonsense. Or do you still think you can beat me? Are you kidding now or not? Hey, what did you come up with? Why are you throwing TNT at me here? JJ, stop it. It's not cool at all. I don't like it. And I hope it's all over soon because this is far from a joke. And I hope that you understand this and you will never contact me again. So let's stop doing all this nonsense already because I don't like it. And I hope that all this will end soon and you're doing everything you can to stop me. I get it right. And so, I hope that everything will be fine with me and you won't do this anymore. Alas, you won't get anything from my resources, so don't even hope for it. And I'll come visit you soon, so get ready to meet me. And if I were you, I would prepare some kind of gift for me because I'm going to destroy you once and for all. Or are you afraid of me? I can see that you're afraid of me. Just don't pretend that it's not true. You can't prove anything to me, so let's get to it. Before our time is up, I want to go on vacation and not do this nonsense with you. What do you think of that? Did you not expect that I would now have a whole army of zombies? Or did you expect it? Or what are you going to tell me now? Come on, try to attack me. Or are you already starting to be afraid of me? But don't be afraid, we'll just destroy you. So come up to me and everything will be fine with us. The main thing is that you're not afraid of me. And anyway, why do you keep doing this? Do you think if you destroy them all, that's the end? But that's not the case at all. I'll be able to summon more new zombies, so your whole fight doesn't make sense, and I advise you to just give up. So, I'm sick of it all. I've already destroyed all your zombies. So you don't have anyone left, and you're doomed to die because I found all your stuff. I have all your weapons, and you don't have any other, and I know it perfectly well. So you don't have to deceive me, you won't succeed, just forget about the fact that you can defeat me. Come on, crawl out of your cave and give me everything you have left here if you want me to give you a chance to win. Otherwise, I'll just completely destroy your chunk, and then you won't be able to convince me. Okay, take everything I have, just don't kill me because I don't want to die. I don't deserve it at all. You understand that too, but I'm asking you not to do anything. Please listen to me, I'm asking you. Why are you destroying everything you have? What did the villager do to you or the house? Or why are you destroying my trees? Have you completely lost your mind already? I gave you everything you asked it for. Now I have nothing at all. What are you trying to achieve with this? I didn't want this to happen. I surrendered to you. Why do you care about me? Because I have to do this. So give up already. You deserve it more than everyone else. So what do you want to watch me destroy your chunk? Aren't you having as much fun as you were when you were laughing at me in the village? Well, now it's my turn to laugh at you, and I will destroy everything related to you and this chunk so that you would still understand that you messed with the wrong one and you should have immediately given up and not waste my time. Okay, I'm tired of this, so I wish you good luck. You're going to need it. Okay, but I wouldn't say that. 
It seems to me that you will need luck now when I throw you to the bottom. Well, are you not so cool anymore? How funny are you anyway? And for this you die. To be honest, I even feel a little sorry for him. I don't know what he felt when he flew to the bottom, but I think it doesn't matter anymore. So what is it? Is it now that I've won this challenge? If that's the case, then I'm good. But where is JJ? He was supposed to appear somewhere here on his chunk. And where should I look for him now? Hmm, after all, this is something strange. I'm already starting to worry. He couldn't have disappeared somewhere or done something so that I couldn't find him anymore. Isn't that right? Huh, he didn't realize that I was able to survive. But that's only good news for me because I'll have the advantage of a surprise attack. Just to start, I have to climb up from here, but it won't be so easy. I fell too low, but I think it's not a problem for me, and I'll get to it no matter what it costs me. Well, I admit that you were able to defeat me. You turned out to be stronger than me this time. You did well, and I lost as always, but we will have more challenges where I can win back, and I will do it. That's right, you said everything right. So guys, if you've watched up to this point, Please like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.